Hey, it's Brad from Omro PC, and I'm here to show you what the inside of a computer looks like after smoking by it. Um, I typically do not recommend smoking by a computer for a number of reasons. Um, one of the biggest reasons is the tar just builds up on all the stuff inside your computer, uh, such as the CPU fan, which is the fan that cools your processor. Um, also, the fans that are inside your power supply, which power the computer. Um, that is very bad. So we're gonna let's take a look and see what happens um, after smoking by a computer. Uh, as you can see, uh, right now we're looking at a heat sink right now. Uh, this is a CPU fan which keeps your processor cool inside the computer. Um, as you're doing things, it kind of heats up, but this keeps it cool. Um, right now it properly it cannot properly cool simply because all of this tar and dust and everything from the cigarettes are just caked on there so it's caked up on the heatsink this is a power supply and the uh, tar and everything inside there get built up on the fans and then the fans eventually stop working and then the power supply might heat up and just fry out you can see it kind of breaking apart as you can see the stuff just cakes right on here and you gotta just take a you just gotta take a toothbrush to get it off. And what I recommend is if, if you know how to properly open your computer case, um, go ahead and do so. Otherwise, um, there are two screws in the back. That every computer is different, but typically there's two screws in the back on each side. Uh, only one side typically opens up. Um, so this side is the the best side to open up right here away from all of this uh, components here so just unscrew the screws off of there this one just has a simple release lever you push and then it just comes right out um, just get a can of compressed air like this and make sure it has a red straw because that is important um, so you can get into every nook and cranny of where you want to blast this dust out um, I typically recommend cleaning your computer every month or so so just kind of blast it in here make sure you keep the can upright because if you tip it upside down um, a lot of cold air is going to come out of it and it could damage your computer so make sure it's upright you just kind of blast in there and you want to get all of that out of here you want to try to get it out of the computer and onto your floor so you can vacuum it off of the floor do not try to use a vacuum cleaner inside your computer because with all that static electricity sucking everything in it could damage something in your computer so just make sure you use this can of forced air you do not want to use an air compressor I do not recommend it some people do but you could damage something if the air pressure is set to too high so we got that, we typically have it on the bottom here so we can just kind of brush it out later on. But this is a CPU fan and what happens is all that tar and everything from the cigarette smoke just build up on there and eventually it just kind of wears the fan out. So that's a little tutorial on how to clean your computer out and uh, you know just make sure that you have a little dirt devil on hand because it does get kind of dusty. So thanks for watching my tutorial and happy computing.